Hi everyone, and thank you so much for joining us for Tuesday's tip. My name is Julie Johnson, and these tips are brought to you by Vine Images. Welcome to week number 31. This week, with the holiday season fast approaching, we're going to be talking about channels. Not TV channels to entertain your clients, but channels in Photoshop. The color channels that allow you to play with your colors in your image. So what we found over um, the past couple weeks, because we're starting Santa sessions, is that a lot of the times you can get reflections of whatever colors um, the babies are wearing onto their face because lights are shining. So we have this red tutu. Sometimes we'll get a red um, hue or their face goes a little bit red because the reflection of the light is hitting the red and bouncing on their face. This can also happen with different color pavements um, when you're doing on location sessions. So you want to watch for color in skin tone. Yellow as well. We're going to go through a sample where this um, child was wearing this yellow tutu and we had the yellow reflected on her face and her arms. So we're going to be showing you how to get rid of the yellow on the skin. But you can also use this for yellow on people's teeth. It's quite an amazing um, tool in Photoshop. So I hope you enjoy this. We're going to go right now to the desktop and we will see you after. Okay, so here we are, we've opened up Photoshop and um, we're just going to go and grab the channels. So they're right over to your right there, usually with layers you can find them. So we're gonna grab the channels and we're gonna just pull it over so it's on its own. So as you can see, there's an RGB, a red, a green, and a blue channel. So this little image was taken today. This little cutie was a little upset and her face became a little bit red. So the goal today is to take the red out of her face. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on the green channel. We're going to um, put the eyes on all the other channels so you can see um, exactly what you're doing. We're going to grab the dodge tool there and uh, we're going to make the brush a little bit bigger, change the opacity down to about nine so it's very subtle. And we're going to dodge um, the green color over top of the red so that brush size is a little too big. So we're going to make the brush smaller, still need it a little smaller. There we go. Okay, so we're just going to subtly dodge um, the green color onto her face, which um, with the red, it just takes it just takes out the red color. It's pretty unbelievable. So right now we're going to make the brush smaller and take out the red over her eyes by just dodging the green there. So you can see the red is gone. Unbelievable. So I'm going to take my history brush, I'm going to make it smaller, and I'm just going to take over her eye because I don't want any green on her eyes. I just want uh, her eyes to be left the way they were. So again, we're going to go back to the dodge and just get rid of more red area in her face. So you can use this with newborn babies, um, with anything. If someone has a uh, um, a red blotch. Um, some people get allergies there. We put a little bit too much green, so we're going to go and take that out in our history. But um, you can use this on any anything. It's pretty amazing technology. So here's the before and after. There's before and there's after. It's very subtle, but makes a huge difference. It's such a great tool to learn how to use. So there we have it. The next image we're going to bring up is the um, yellow. So on the color wheel, guys, the opposite of um, yellow is blue and of red is green. So this is how you want to um, play with your channels. So right now, if there's yellow, you want to use the opposite on the color channel. So we want to go to the blue. And there's a yellow on her face and on her arm we want to get rid of. So we're going to go to the blue channel and, uh, and light all those up and we're going to dodge the blue over the yellow. You can also use this with people with yellow teeth. So you would dodge their teeth blue and it would take the yellow right out. It's such a great tool to learn how to use and to play with. So here we go, we're just subtly taking out the, uh, the yellow with the opacity set to nine and we're dodging the green over top of all the yellow areas. Okay, so um, this is so much fun. I love doing this and playing with Photoshop. So there you go. The yellow is gone from, uh, from her face.
Okay, so we're going to go um, to the before here, show you the difference. So there you go, you can see the hue of yellow, and now it's gone. So now there's a little bit of red on her fingers. We're going to go to the green um, tool and dodge the, uh, the green over top of the red to take out the red. And there you have it. So we did a little bit too much there. We're going to put some red back in. Um, so if there's green color, guys, you would dodge with red. On behalf of Vine Images, we just want to thank you so much for joining us for Tuesday's tip. Leave your comments below. We appreciate them, and we hope you learned something new from this. We'll talk to you soon. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.